Hello bee people, welcome back to another episode of Let's Talk About Bees. My name is Humberto and today we're going to be talking about bee propolis. I'm going to be answering three of your questions. So let's begin. <laughs> Okay, so first question about bee propolis, and in case you missed it, I made a, a video about what is bee propolis and the health benefits of bee propolis uh, a while ago, so you can check it on the card above, uh, so you get really informed about bee propolis. But the first question that I got is, can children consume bee propolis? And the general answer is yes. It is safe for children to consume it uh, because the main concern usually uh, with foods and children is allergies and most of the allergies come from proteins and bee propolis have no protein at all so uh, it would be safe for children to consume it and to reap the benefits uh, that bee propolis has to offer. So yeah, go ahead for it. So the, the second question that I got is, is propolis and honey the same? So uh, on the previous video that I made about bee propolis, I explained what propolis actually is, but I'm gonna make a, a quick summary here to explain the differences between bee propolis and honey. So propolis and honey both are products from collection. So bees go out uh, in the nature to collect uh, propolis and nectar. Nectar is the uh, main ingredient for the bees to make honey and that nectar comes from flowers. On the other hand, bee propolis, bee propolis is a resin and that resin is collected from uh, a different species of trees and shrubs uh, but uh, the propolis is secreted by uh, those trees and shrubs uh, on the buds of uh, the new leaves or in the barracks uh, of, these, of these trees. So it is a resin that bees collect uh, for them to use inside a, a hive uh, for various purposes. One of them is, to, uh, is, is like a glue, so it's uh, used to seal cracks and join stuff together inside the hive and it has the benefit uh, also uh, for the bees that it has uh, some health benefits for the bees as well uh, so they uh, use it and spread around the, the hive so the main difference uh, between bee propolis and honey is that honey comes from nectar that is collected from flowers and bee propolis comes from uh, trees and shrubs from the barks that uh, or buds of the new leaves that these trees or shrubs secrete. So the last question that I'm gonna be talking about in this video is how do you take bee propolis? So basically you can find bee propolis in two different ways. One is a dry extract uh, which you can take in pills and the other one is a liquid extract. So the liquid extract can be um, found in two different ways as well. One is an alcoholic extract and the other one is a water-based extract. The alcoholic extract uh, can be quite harsh, so you have to take it diluted in water. Uh, probably you dilute about 20 drops of this uh, alcoholic extract in water and you drink it as it is. Or you can uh, find a water-based extract and you can take it straight because it's not as harsh as the alcoholic extract. Uh, the extract that you can find in uh, pills uh, is basically the uh, alcoholic extract that has been uh, dehydrated or the uh, alcohol has been removed. So it is in a powder form and put into pills and you take uh, those pills. So those are basically the three forms that you can find bee propolis and you can consume it. Uh, sometimes the alcoholic or the water-based extract uh, can be mixed with some other ingredients and uh, to form a throat spray. 
So uh, you just uh, spray a couple of times in your mouth uh, this, this uh, uh, propolis extract mixed with uh, honey and uh, probab probably some essential oils and uh, you're good to go. Okay guys, so that's it for this week. So as always, remember if you like these kind of videos, remember to hit the subscribe button, the thumbs up button and ring the bell so you won't miss in any other future videos. And as always, if you have any other questions about bee products or bees in general, just let us know on the comments below and we'll ha be happy to answer them all in future videos. So see you next time. Thank you very much. Bye bye.